Welcome back to Vixens, ladies and gentlemen. As we're about set for our very first match on our debut edition. And it is for the Vixens Tag Championship. And earlier tonight, before we went to break, Tifa made a statement that every week the Vixens Tag Championship will be defended. So, so apparently they're, they want to issue an open challenge to anybody and every week. I don't know why the, why, why the team say want to do that. Apparently they want to prove everybody how good they are. So, in result, Usagi and Makoto accepted the challenge and now you got this match just to start up on our, our debut edition of Vixens. You know the whole story with Usagi, or Usagi is late earlier back at the, uh, the war zone she lost her chance at the, at the Vixens championship but uh, it was all because of her little mistake wait a minute oh what a splash to the outside but I was talking about what was you like thinking about what she did Back on the war zone before divide and conquer. I mean, she had she had a chance, and all of a sudden, I don't know, we don't even know if it's intentional or not, but she elbowed the women, women's excuse me, the Vixens champion, Aerith Gainsborough, which then led to soccer being in a shot. But as you know, you saw they can, I'll, I'll talk about divide and conquer in a little while, but what's up? I don't know what was wrong with Usagi, but hopefully, they, hopefully it's a little minor. Right now, we got to get back to this match here because Ami Mizuno and Usagi are going at it now. And an interesting fact here, folks, that Ami and Usagi were part of the two-on-one match against Mio Kuroki on the debut of the War Zone. That's what was the very first match. A little factoid, but um, I don't know if you know what happened to Neil lately, a couple nights ago, but um, uh, I think you probably would know if you, if you did watch Divided Conquer. I'm making a spur. I mean, Divided Conquer is still up, so I'm going to watch it. Well, let's get back to this match here because Tifa and Ami, TXA, doing one heck of a job here on Yasagi, and Yasagi didn't even get a tag yet. Smart. Yeah, Yasagi never had a tag yet. Six A's doing a lot of good tagging, but wait a minute, Yasagi now picking Tifa up, and I think this is the moon driver. And here goes the pitfall. One, two, two we'll see. No. And you saw you got a little upset over it. Yet she is the longest person in this match thus far. Trying to fight back and help her and Makoto become three-time women's tag team champions, or should we say now the Vixens tag champions? I think it could be the two lately, so bear with me on that one. Anyways, now Tifa now with the Tifa lock. But it really had to be broken up because of the rope break. Unbelievable. Gotta have more strong ring presence here, Tifa. All those. Right to the right to the ring post. And now both ladies are counting each other here. So I can go back and forth here. Goodness. Sagi needs a tag here somehow. And finally, she gets it. In comes Makoto for the first time in this match. One. If you go back to uh, the very first episode of Warzone this season, 
saw that it was a dramatic change in the, the senshi form. But this time they want to make it so big. Well, make it safe enough for to be compatible. Competable. I got a sound system. Right. Damn. Tifa and Makoto are like the tough ladies of this match. And then wait a minute. Chop away on Usagi. And, oh, whoa, wait a minute. That's, um, that was a little weird. Kind of interesting tank there from Usagi. She wants to be tanked right back in. I don't know what the, the purpose of that was. Wait a minute, there's a pinfall, and right away Makoto gets in and saves the, the pinfall. TSA double teaming here on Usagi once more. Usagi now trying to come back here. I mean, Usagi's on the wrong side of the ring right at this moment. Where TSA's tick kept right here and looks like Tifa's going to try for the meteor kick. Just like she did and in Agent 47. Did she get it? Yes, she did! Dexter Clark! One, two, three! And TXA successfully defended their Vixen Tag Championship. The one problem out of Makoto and Usagi lately was Usagi herself. She was in there the longest, and she has to realize that she has to keep her color in because she wants to get, she wants to freshen up. She's got to stay out. Unfortunately, that was not the case, and this is the result. We'll be back for more, folks.